Hey, this is Dr. Barry. In this short video, I want to talk to you about a subject that I get asked about all the time in the ketogenic groups and the low carb, high fat groups, and that is can I eat keto if I've had bariatric surgery? If I've had a ruin Y, if I've had the gastric sleeve, if I've had the donut, can I still enjoy all the wonderful benefits of eating a ketogenic diet? Now, hundreds of thousands of people have undergone this gut crippling surgery in an attempt to lose weight. And if you know someone who's had bariatric surgery, there's about 20 different types. But if you know someone like that and, and they're, they've gained the weight back, which we'll talk about in a minute, please consider sharing this video with them on Facebook or on YouTube or on your email. Send them a text message. Help them understand that they too can benefit from the ketogenic way of eating. So many people who have had bariatric surgery have been told you can't do keto. And so I think they'll be very happy to find out that they can. So let's talk about this. Bariatric surgery is touted by many in the medical profession as the answer for morbid obesity. Even more and more, there's uh, doctors and experts are starting to proclaim bariatric surgery as the answer for type 2 diabetes. Now, this is beyond me, but... A lot of people fall for this, and they, they have one type of bariatric surgery or the other, hoping to magically lose the weight without having to suffer any consequences. Uh, there's several things that most people who've had bariatric surgery do find out, and that is that there are consequences, often lifelong maladies that will haunt them, sometimes severe surgical side effects. This uh, is a huge surgery and it's not without its complications. But here's the very interesting thing and the very disappointing thing. If you look at people who've had bariatric surgery and you follow them over time, at about the 10-year mark, 90% of them have gained back all the weight that they lost from the bariatric surgery. So at that point, you would think that bariatric surgeons and other uh, internists who are promoting this as the answer for morbid obesity would think, well, really, I should probably temper my recommendation and say it's it's a temporary solution for obesity because you're going to gain back your weight within 10 years. So with that being said, you've already had the bariatric surgery. Now, can you eat keto or not? And so here's my answer. Yes. Yes, you can. People who have had bariatric surgery can enjoy all the health benefits from eating a ketogenic diet, but you have to come at it a little differently than the average person. Uh, more than likely, you're only able to eat very small amounts of food. If you eat too much food or too much fat at one time, you're going to have gastric or uh, bathroom issues pretty quickly thereafter. And so that prevents a lot of people who have had bariatric surgery from even thinking that they can have, enjoy keto because it's so high fat. Here's the steps that you're going to take. If you have had bariatric surgery and you're currently eating the standard diet, <clears throat> here's what you're going to do. Over the next few weeks, you're going to slowly decrease your total carbs each day, and you're going to slowly increase your fat intake in grams each day. As you do this slowly, it's going to help your body get used to this. It's going to help your liver ramp up bile production. It's going to help your gallbladder get used to, if you still have a gallbladder, get used to this amount of fat again. Now, probably you'll never be able to eat one meal a day like some people who eat keto do. But definitely you can eat two or three meals a day. You can even intermittent fast, but you may never be able to, to have an intermittent fast that's 22 or, or more hours long. You'll probably have to have a 16 or 18 hour fast each day and then have a six or eight hour feeding window during which you eat two or three or even four meals with your fat and your other macros divided up into those meals. If you do it that way, you can eat keto and you can actually lose the weight that you regained after your bariatric surgery and you can keep that weight off from now on by eating keto from now on. So also another thing that you have to do if you've had bariatric surgery and you're eating keto is you have to take your supplements. You have to keep taking those. And it's not because the ketogenic diet is deficient in vitamins and minerals. It's because your gut absorption has been damaged. It's been crippled by the surgery. And you'll never again absorb your vitamins and minerals and other nutrients as efficiently as you once did. <clears throat> So you need to take your multivitamin, your supplements, just like you did back when you were eating the standard diet. Another thing you need to do is have your routine lab work checked with your doctor. 
not because the ketogenic diet is deficient in any vitamins or minerals, but because your gut has been crippled in its ability to absorb the vitamins and minerals that are in a ketogenic diet. But when all is said and done, you may not be able to do it exactly the way other people do it. You may never be able to eat one meal a day or fast for long periods of time, but you can absolutely enjoy the benefits of a healthy fat, low carb diet and reap all the health benefits that it has to offer you. Now, if you enjoyed this video, please consider clicking the subscribe button. It's right down there, and right beside it's a little bell. If you click that, every time I have a bright idea, you will be one of the very first people to know. If my videos have touched you and maybe even helped your health a little bit, you can click on my Patreon link down below, sign up quickly, and throw a buck or two my way. It gives me more time to make videos just like this one so I can help more people. This is Dr. Barry. I'll see you next time.